Rider here and we're back with another explore. So today we're going to be headed out to an abandoned religious retreat and I'm going to be exploring with two friends of mine, Resting Raven and Mon Valley Paranormal Society. So I will put links to their channels in the description. You should check them out. They're really cool. Uh, so without further ado, let's explore. So this is the outside of all of the structures. I'm just doing a 360 to try and show all of them. Um, this place is huge. There's no way I'm going to be able to record all of it. However, I'm going to show you guys what uh, I thought was the most interesting so that you can come along and see what it's like. So this is the first structure that we're going to explore today. Just gonna head down here. So excited to see what I can find. Wow. That stained glass is absolutely gorgeous. So, I don't really know what this is besides a hanging Jesus statue, but there it is anyways. Also, windows, because gorgeous. So, now we're just going to head down here into a different area. Now, as you can tell, this building still has power, um, so the fire alarms keep beeping. Not annoying at all. Uh, but this area, I really loved because of all of that paint that's just falling off the walls. Hmm, more of that beautiful stained glass. So now I'm going to head the opposite way down this hall and found some cool things on the way. Like this book of something or other. Also this painting. This needs no explanation. <laughs> So relatable. Now that we've made it to the end of the hall, we'll see what's in here. Some books. Bibles stacked over there. Doesn't look like much on the other side. A little closer view of the Bibles. So many. And then I want to see what's uh, over here on the right. I'm real fast. More books. Imagine that. And just where it's left behind. So we're going to head to that hall there. But I saw this on the way. I bet you that's like a YouTube or an Instagram or something. But yeah, I'm going to head to that hallway on the right. So I wonder what's in here. A pretty trashed room, looks like. Nothing too interesting. So let's see what's down this way. So down we go. So far I found a chair. Pretty interesting stuff, am I right? A 
fairly empty room. Not much there. This was across the hall. Looks like uh, storage cabinets for tools and whatnot. Down the hall further we go. Another storage area. This is a lot of wood. Hmm, <laughs> that's what she said. Well, up it is. Oh, this is just the other area. So we're gonna do a walk. And we're gonna walk some more. And some more. But finally, we're back to the place of the windows. Which I'm going to show again because they are just so incredibly gorgeous. So this is what was on the altar across from some communal wine, because why not, you know? And this cool little candle. I like the reflection there. Don't tell me how to live my life. I am such a rebel. Oh, I found glitter. Oh, come on camera, focus, focus, focus. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Sorry guys, you know, phone, camera, what you gonna do? Anyways, this is the second structure, building, whatever. I'm gonna show you guys this room here because the police department uses it as training grounds. So there was all of these pictures everywhere um, with bullet holes through them. See the guy in there? Um, and all of the shelves were just littered about the ground. It's kind of interesting, actually. And this room is right across the hall from the other one. Big and open. And on the other side of the wall here was this um, kid drawing little area. And they had little owls. So cute. More walking. It's very, very illegal. Down we go. And here we are to the floor below. So we're going to head over here first. And it's a big auditorium slash gym. And you can see the guys over there. Hi guys! So now we're going to explore down the hallway. Mm, another cute little drawing here. And an arts room. It's cool. They were probably something of like actual, like good metal, so they stole them out. So I'm walking to the next building and I just wanted to show off all the pretty flowers. They make me so happy. So can we all just take a moment to appreciate how gorgeous it is here? So we found this little shrine thing, I guess you'd call it. I found the bird's nest. Oh my goodness, so cute. 
I also found more flowers. So this is the next area that we explored. And I love this room. Spooky, scary hallway. So I'm going to see what's to the right here. But down the hallway, we have a ping pong table. So this area is actually apartments. Um, probably should have explained that before, but that's why they've got like this little rec area. And up we go again. Get my cardio in. And over here we just have a little room. And I really thought that this divider was really cool. Just another small little room. And we saw the mama bird sitting on her little baby. So cute. So this is the last building that we're going to explore today. And first I'm going to head just straight down this hallway. And here is the cleanest bathroom I have ever seen in a bando. Remarkable, really. Down we go. Some really ugly carpet. Somebody's been stacking chairs. Down more stairs. Here we have a pool table, another little rec area, just some more spooky, scary hallways. Finally, some light. Anybody need a lamp? Going once? Going twice? No? Oh. <laughs> okay. Ooh, that's a lot of dirt. And found a cool little piano. Or organ, I guess. It's an organ. I'm smart, I swear. So I'm just going to show you guys a couple more bedrooms and then call it a day. The thing that I will say about all of these rooms is that they were very clean. Despite all the paint coming off, um, for bando standards, they really weren't that bad. Later, Bando. <laughs> it's so strange. There's, there's some kids up in this field that have... So that was a really cool place. It was so huge, uh, but it was so much fun to explore all the different rooms. We did actually end up running into a band of explorers, and it was really cool to meet new people that were into the same hobby. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you liked the video. I, if you want, you can subscribe. I'm so awkward. <laughs> if you want, you can subscribe. I'm going to try and put out new videos every Friday. However, 
I think it's just so awesome that you're watching it all. So thank you so much and uh, I'll see you next week. Bye.